Hello, welcome to another video. Uh, I've got this Unimoke battery in today. It's a 48 volt, 14.5 amp hour pack uh, with the key in the on position here. That happens. Nothing. If you turn it off, you get the briefest of flashes on the uh, power there. If you plug in the charger, it does light up the lights. So there's something dead and unhappy occurring inside. Um, not sure if it's fuse related yet, but if it is, you won't see this video. I'm pretty sure it's not going to be. Um, at the charge port, we have 44.8 volts. And I think we've got the same at the discharge ports, 43 volts. So, it's not completely dead, but it won't put out any power or turn on the little lights. So I'm thinking the BMS has tripped for some reason. Plugging the charge does no good. I think we pop it open and have a little look together. Uh, to open up these packs, you've got four screws. One, two, three, four. They'll be, I don't know if that's a Philips or a Posi, but one of them. Four. And the long screws go in this side, the lock side. Okay, quite nice in here. Got lots of delicious silicon holding everything up together. Key switch, which actually cuts the power. It all feeds through the key switch. Uh, charge port there with much hot glue. I seem to recall in the past I might have actually replaced this charge port myself. No, I haven't because that silicon's still on it. Uh, disconnect that for a second. And then we've got the cells, etc., all in here. Um, I don't know how they're attached. I can't quite get to the JST yet. Healthy bashing. Nope, it's not going to do it. It's not going to be enough. If I can pull this. It's funny, it's the, the, this is a normal BMS, but it's mounted on this really big circuit board. Huh. It's pretty cool. Uh, let's see what kind of voltage we've got from... well one of the reds I'll check it in a second and see one of the positives to the B minus terminal the bashy minus the bashy negative 49.13 alpha one bugger all and that one should be bugger all 4 volts Yeah, 44.75. So why won't it charge? Is what we want to look at. Uh, had out a pick. What is that called? Don't know. Lost it. There it is. Uh, if we get our pick, we might be able to just loosen this JST off and check the cell voltages. There it goes. God, not much chance of getting anything in there, is there? Pain in the arse. Not too sure how we've got to loosen this <clears throat> up, this whole situation. If it's attached from the bottom or anything, get a bit of a wiggle with this, shall we? I'm guessing. 
some loads of silicon or something holding it onto the bottom. Not much in the way of movement. Let's have a look at the lower end of this then, the underside. These screws will all be the same length on the bottom. There's that. Ah, this is the repair I had to do. <laughs> the uh, this port here was pushed in. I had to just do a bit of fixing. Unplug that. It's nice that they're all on uh, connectors. What's not so nice is that nothing wants to move. How on earth do we get into you? I wonder. Kind of looks like there's four somethings along there. Let's pry at some of this and see what what does what. Again, hopefully this is just a plastic cover. That's yes. I think it all drops. Out. Aha! Yep, it does. It all drops out the bottom. There we go. Um. In here we've got some nice spot welds, big sheet. Don't know what cells they are, but they're that colour there, which normally means Samsung something or other. Can't see any of them. I don't really want to mess with it if I don't have to. Let's get my tester on and we'll measure the JST. See what it says. See what it says. only 12 groups. The 13th group is not showing. Is that to do with me? Or to do with it? Hopefully we've not got a dead 13th group of cells here. Which will be the ones on the positive end. So these last two here between here and here. 0 0.8 volts. Yep, we've got a dead group of cells. Great. And here we've got 4 volts, 4 volts, 4 volts, 4 volts. Yeah, what the, uh, what the tester was showing me. That's unfortunate. That's very unfortunate. Um, okay, well, um, we'll have to do a bit more looking at what cells they are exactly, how we can even get into this. Ah, wait, what's this? Water, rusty. I reckon if I zoom you in to that there. Ooh. One day I'll get it. Uh, this cell here probably going to be the bad one, isn't it? Doesn't look too happy at all. All sorts of Nasty bad rusty water around there. Dread to think. Probably a dead cell has drug, drug, taken the whole group down. This side here as well. Uh, there. It's all full of old. Ugh. Yeah. a 13S 5P pack, 1, 2, 3, 4, 5, and yeah, you see this cell here will be knackered unfortunately, that's a shame, oh, we can rebuild this pack for the customer, we'll just uh, 
have a chat to them about it, I think. Have a talk. Thanks for watching.